Hello peeps and welcome back to the next episode of our Space Haven Adventures. Why is OBS turning red and green all the time? You guys let me know if the stream's okay or not. Let's just unpause this game because we have business to do here. So, uh, where are we? Ah, right. So, we are doing that thing. That's done, right? Is it? Do we need anything? Low, low, none. Nah. Doesn't matter. Okay, guys. Now I'm trying something new just because I had to set up the stream again like for Space Haven because I streamed something else recently and uh, I turned off the uh, you know 30 second thing responses so you will let me know how this works uh, post surgery I yeah so where are we which which teams are available right now so team two is going to bed soon so probably team three and four team three what's wrong with terry where's terry terry what's your issue chronic wound minor discomfort crawl a bite huh okay team four then Quinn, Steph, Hans, and Toru. Why not? You guys are armed. SMG, laser, SMG. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That looks good to me. Everybody has armors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Okay, let's draft you guys. That was team four. Let's draft you guys and you get in here. There we go. Hey, Alboon, how's it going? Ein schönes Bier nach dem hektischen Tag. Ja, ja, in der Tat. <laughs> I'm not going to switch to German, don't worry. It's just, uh, if somebody writes something in German, I probably also should have the courtesy of replying as well in German. <clears throat> yeah, basically, um, we. I'll show you in a second where we are on the map. And um, we pretty much reached the end game, like being totally overpowered, I guess. And uh, that, that, that's kind of fun. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> Excel sucks. Oh, or no, if you know what you're doing. Um, seven, oh, I smell aliens. Awesome. Hello. That's going to be a fun encounter. <laughs> so, you, Elbun, you're also playing Space Haven? Or in which game are you going to fight aliens? <clears throat> Oh. Is our ship coming? There, please. There. Stop going where I have to zoom. Go where I told you to. That actually is going to be really interesting with that kind of troop. Because they are kind of the least battle-ready, kind of. Quinn. <clears throat> Let's shoot that.
Quinn, you probably want to get back there. And the rest of you guys, you advance. Okay, so we've taken out this alien there. Perfect. Awesome. Um, eventually... That's it? That, that, that already was it? Oh, look, there's a guy. Awesome. Um, Space Haven. Ah, cool. We started it last Friday. Got any issues with the game? Hopefully not. Toro, you go here. You two undraft. So that's that ship, right? Yes. Transfer. Oh, nice. All of that. Let's see, what can we salvage here? Let's salvage that, that, that. Yeah. <clears throat> Come on, show this message. <clears throat> I don't know, like YouTube tried blocking your, your chat thing. Even if I have two shields and four energy cannons. Yeah, the thing is, uh, the energy cannons do not do hull damage. <laughs> so basically you are just, um, you know, destroying the shields. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh! Mm-hmm. Um, one thing of advice though, fighting pirates, you probably were not in the late game then. Okay, hold on a sec, because we got a new guy. First, I need to find Toru, there he is, and undraft him. And now we have Mavis. Who is Mavis? Oh, I like Mavis. That's six weapons that we don't need at all. Eight, nine medical, eight in botany, five in industry, and two in mining. I like Mavis. Okay, let's un uh, do that and let's um, also undraft this. That's perfect. Yeah. They come with three ships. Ah. Look, the one thing uh, people need to really get about Space Haven is that stuff can only happen if the player is watching. If the player is not watching, meaning the player is not in the same sector, Nothing is going. Nothing is going to happen there. You can have slavers, pirates, and military alliance all in the same sector, and they are not going to do a thing to each other. But if you jump in, then suddenly they are all going to shoot each other. And because you are, you cannot watch enemy ships, like from the inside. That is why they cannot. They don't have to reload turrets or stuff like that. They can fire for ages. So, oh, by the way, Team One's alive. Uh, Paisley, where's Paisley? Where's Paisley? Paisley? In here. I want this. Where is it? Let's see, Paisley. There we go. 
Uh, please return home. Okay, Team Vaughn. Uh. Anyway, <clears throat> because you cannot uh, check in on the enemy ship until you capture it, um, they do not have to reload stuff. So, um, since your energy turrets need um, ammunition, their energy turrets are going to outgun you. So, what you really need is... Um, uh, who's in there? Nobody. Draft. Dock. There. Go. <coughs> So, because, um, yeah, that's the thing why you should have loads of those. Because they do one damage to shield, but they also do one damage to hull. Now, for shield, I have those, and for hull, I have those. Um, should it really come to a fight. But if I can prevent it, I'd rather, um, you know, uh, use only the auto turrets to do the work because um, the other turrets, well, they require ammunition, right? So probably not the best idea. Uh, let's stock here. I think I was just mining and so on and suddenly the pirates came. I tried to attack them but died. Uh, they can't appear suddenly. You always see them up here coming. Probably you just didn't check. Uh, where is the shuttle? There it comes. Good. So where is the other shuttle? The other shuttle is then, I think, doing the work here. Steph's in here. Mavis is over there. Mavis, ah, you're holding one of those. Okay. Yeah, well. Blap. There we go. Blap. Get out. Ah. Ah, aliens. Let's see. Let's get over here. And you dock down there. Oh, Memphis. Who is Memphis? He's hostile to us, isn't he? Are you are we shooting him? You know what? Let's just go that way. Oops. Oops. <laughs> ah. Go. Hey, you got what's going on? You guys go over here. Yeah, take take the least, you know. Okay, did we clean this up? Perfect. Awesome. I I saw them coming, wanted to try my weapons and was trying to use only energy weapons. To avoid using ammo, haha. <laughs> okay, need to read the docs. Yeah, actually, um, 
if you check in here, the energy tower, shield damage three, hull damage zero. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know. <laughs> yeah, but the good thing is, um, I guess this is all part of the learning curve. You are not going to make those mistakes again. Hello. I like Mavis too, by the way. Credits, cool. What? Environmental condition? Where? Maybe it's... Okay, mate. Oh, hold on. Yeah, that shows you how lazy I am in reading. <laughs> I wouldn't call it lazy. It's just like, it's a turret. Why shouldn't the turret work, right? <laughs> ah, more goodies over there. Cool. And food and such. Cool. Let's get that. Let's get that. So the last guy that opposes our Victory should be in there. <clears throat> no. Are we done? No. Ah, it's uh, one of the floaty types, right? Let's get a better overview here. There we go. There we go. So let's undraft them. Let's transfer everything. That's good, actually. I like water, energy. Yeah, why not? And let's do pretty much the same thing here. Awesome. Um, shuttle, you're undrafted. There we go. Okay, chat. Okay, mate. Time to bring the kids in bed. Catch you later. If I, you're still, yeah, I'm going to stream for like one and a half hours, something like that. So, um, about time I speed up the game, I guess. And then we are. You, 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 you catch me later. Why is it not done then? Ah, there we go.
Josephina is all right. Um, speed one. Okay. Ah! I traded with you guys already, didn't I? Yeah, 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 I did. It's so funny, like these tiny ships compared to ours. Okay, so we have 14 of those, 6 of these, we have quite a lot of that stuff, that's good. Let's see, what can we, tr oh, we get that stuff, yeah, I like that. Poor Memphis though, we didn't, we weren't even able to check his stats. What a bummer. <laughs> mm. We have a new crew member. That means We also need a new hypersleep chamber. Jaina, what did you get? The implanted rebreather. Cool. You are already an awesome beast. Um, let's quickly check. Mavis. Where are you? Uh, in which team do I want you to be? So, okay, team like search shift has one, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten people. Second shift has two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine people. I want Mavis to be in the second shift then, I guess. Uh, 
Um, free time. There we go. Okay, at some time, I really need to redo those because then I have to re, um, you know, <clears throat> put the shooting squads together differently and then have them like in different shifts for that regard. For example, if, if I have 10, no, 12, how many sleeping places do we have? That's four on that side, six on that side. So 12. I'd like to have like 14. Yeah, well, 12 is okay, I guess. Because, yeah, well, no, we should have 14. Yeah, we should have 14 because um, the thing is, uh, 14 would be 42 then. We need even, yeah, we need 16 then. That would be 30, 48. Yeah, that's more close to 50 people. Because that ship kind of is, is designed, you know, to support about 50 people. Um... So that means we need four more crew quarters. No problem. Oh, by the way, last episode I said I'd build a turret here. Let's do that. Coplam. There we go. That's cool. Where is... Oh, did I? Yes. There it is. How is our water vapor doing? Down to 3%. Awesome. <coughs> That will eventually rise when I do more of the botany stuff in here. But right now it seems we like still have so much stuff. Nine of these. I'm still thinking about how to do those, kinda. Oh, hold on, my dishwasher is beeping me into psychological, you know, I need to turn it off before I get crazy. Ooh. Way better. <clears throat> We're done. Sitting down again. So I'm wondering if we could Oops. Let's say we would then we could Huh. If we go like, that doesn't make a room though. Okay, so 
that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fourteen, twenty eight, and nine are thirty seven. So we need another thirteen. So if we go like Uh, no facility. There, there we go. Thirteen, so fourteen. Again. If we go like fourteen, means seven on each side. One like this, then another one like that, and then we could actually have another one like this if we remove the wall. That would be three. I'd like to know if, let me quickly pause the game and check something out. If I place this like that, and then uh, a, a power, that thing. Nah, that doesn't work. Okay, mm -hmm. got it. So we need a few more of those. Huh. I like the idea though, using up this space, like they have to walk around this and they're all, you know, cryo chambers here. Let's let the game run. Um, people are doing fine in here, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Lots of people transferring lots of stuff. That's good. Tax crap, awesome. Me likes. Vara is back on her feet. Awesome. Another text grab. We're getting lots of lots of text grab from those. Hardly any energy scrap, but that doesn't matter. Now this looks like we are going to have our turret finally. So that is going to make those seven turrets, seven of those auto turrets. Meow. Hey sweetie, how's it going? Oh, here, cutest thing. Lay down sweetie, I can't see the monitor if you're standing there. Huh? Oh, lay down. Come on, lay down. Oh, lay down. Oh, hey. Oh, <laughs> exactly. Okay, enough cat content for today. Hopefully. Depends on... Okay, military alliance is going again. Perfect. Mas Paloma shield. Oops. Yeah, that is, you know. Oh, and we are researching our final tech, are we not? Yes. <laughs> Still wondering what to put there then next. What is this tech going to give us anyway? Recovery and learning. No, we don't need either. But it's good to be done with the tech tree then. In my next playthrough, I'm probably going to limit um, the max skill to six in learning because that really is not required higher. When they achieve six, like from two or three starting, there we go, close, 
Can we do any more research? Now we're done. We did it. We did. We did unlock the entire tech tree. Awesome. Let's disassemble that. Ah, uh, you are going to take a nap, are you not? Yeah, low energy cannot work. Go back in here. Come on. Do it. Blop. And there we go. You have point seven. Awesome. So now we can really think about finalizing this entire ship in here. We are just, I feel, we are just lacking. Yes, they need energy blocks and we are at a minimum. So that's probably not going to work out for a little more time. Anyway, as we have done all that, we should have enough stuff to, yeah, let, you know, let's just go for another spin and let's see where we are we in the universe. All right. Yeah, we did. We did all that. We did all that. Now we just need to research all of that. And in here, I think there was another pirate ship. We are probably going to blow that thing to pieces. No. Anybody doing the navigation job? No? Ah, by the way, Mavis. Mavis. Where is Mavis? There's Mavis. I want you. Um, primary weapon. Get an assault rifle. Do we have one? No. Get an SMG then. Yeah, we have lots of those. Yeah, get an SMG and get some armored vest. Picked it up. Are you sleeping right now? Yeah, sorry. Sorry for waking you up. And Haruka just got an implant, am I right? Cerebral cap. What does that do again? Oh, accident minus 12. That's good. Prefrontal mind controller. That is doing the weapons one thing. That's cool. Because then we also have a great shooter. Ah, then she just gets to five. Yeah, that's cool. Because she's clumsy. <laughs> so Mavis fetches her stuff and goes back to sleep also. Cool. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> like, I'm really wondering what we could put. If we leave that thing here, which is all right, we could put... But that would be a big waste of space, I guess. I was thinking about putting uh, one of the solar panels there. But that's five in size. So that would be a big waste of space. By the way, do we have, yes, we still have one more. Um, how about we do like 
that thing here. And over there, we do an airlock, like that thing. Like such. That I think would be cool. Because we have an airlock here, so we don't need an airlock there, so rather have an airlock over there. So have, we have one further to the front. Hmm. <coughs> Gur. Ah, are we ready to jump now? Yes. Okay. Oh, we haven't searched. Yeah, that's a shortcut. It feels like. We have been trading with those, right? Yeah. Let's go here. Uh, let's go there. Let's follow those civilians. We are still... Oh, that ceasefire is still in, in a action. You know, as long as the ceasefire is still there, we could do that thing. But first we should get that. drop here. This is kind of strange, like that the ceasefire is globally for everybody who is part of the pirate faction. That's kind of, you know, really? <laughs> Let's do some mining. Kitty cat, what's wrong? Why are you going? Meow. Come here, sweetie. Yeah, I still would like to blow these pirates into pieces. I mean... Can we do anything to them break the ceasefire? Are they still being recruited? They are. Especially her I'd like to have because uh, she's the lover of what a, wait a second no where is he Arik lovers there we go I hope she's going to join us soon There we go. That means now we have 2K power storage. Awesome.
Let's do that. Franklin and Paisley doing it, awesome. I really like that this ship has hardly any bots, like just two of the normal ones and one of the salvage bots. Because we have so much crew, like they can do all the logistics, so we don't have to waste space on the bots. Ah, slavers were there. There is still a slaver's ship here. Interesting. Uh huh. Okay. I kind of want to get them. drop that's that will be free resources uh, like that deploy in which shift that will be the second shift okay Let's speed up time a bit. <clears throat> Four, three, Two. Give me two. There we go. So which who one is going to sleep? Mm -hmm. So I want shields up, turrets up, and. Hello, Steph. You good at gunning? That's decent. Who is going to do the shield job? Stella. Three. Hmm. Not really, no. Well, whatever. I 
I'm actually thinking we are OP enough to can train our weaker crew members. Come on, one hour. Do it. Paisley Post surgery? No. Chronic wound? Crawler bite. Ah, okay. Where are they? There we go. Okay, let's blow them to pieces. They got shields. Let's try to take those shields out. And the guns. Actually, no, you go. For that thing. Let's start the fight. Uh, soon they are trying to activate their um, engines as soon as they take um, yeah they take damage let's prevent that from happening Uh, actually, we do not need that. All we need to do is go like here and go like there. Yeah. So just to make sure we reign supreme here. No. Nope. And we are done. Good. 
Perfect. That was quick. Um, good. What next? What are they trying to do? I can unload these, unload those. Go in that view back. Who is team two should be available and team three and team four. Let's see, team two, you are available. Awesome. Team three, you are kind of fresh. Stella, what's wrong with you? Oh yeah, you, you're drafted. And Terry, what's wrong with you, Terry? Okay, team four. Four. Hmm. Anyway, three and four, you are going into the pots. Three. Aharuka can't. Post search racing, what did you get? Uh, still just the rebroke cap. Okay, two then. Draft. Get in there. And four. Draft. Get in there. Stella is still doing the shielding. Awesome. So, what are you trying to do now? What is wrong? Actually, let's go, let's dock back there, accept, and four, you, dock, there, Accept. Yeah, let's do it that way. And we would still have team three to deal with any shenanigans. Are they trying to load their shuttles? Let's see how much ammunition did we fire up? Quite a bit. But still we have like all of that stuff. Still nobody in there. Preparing boarding party. Nice. Me too, by the way. Just saying. Hold on a sec. That means team two is going to sleep soon. 
and team two we have here oh yeah well <laughs> let's make it quick then dock there any boarding party here no boarding party here mm-hmm awesome Um, so team three, except Haruka, so Terry, Stella, and Jennifer. Let me expand this. Jennifer, Stella, and Terry draft. I am thinking those guys probably want to end up on that side just because it's the shorter one Oh, uh, team three. Uh, you crunch. Oh, Terry, you are the one with the um, yeah. Okay, who is here? Um, team one. Let's back you guys up. Team two. Ah, they've given up already. Awesome.
So you are you are a good gunner. Me likes. So who needs you talk to him and make him follow um, Toru you be drafted as well you hold on a sec what are you your Android collective Toru you free prisoner I guess what are you merchant federation okay Jaina you talk to him Hans get in there You talk to her. Now, do I have to manually tell them to follow? Follow me. And then Toru, you get in there. Now, where's Jaina? There's Jaina. Tell him to follow. No. Free the prisoner first. Okay. Quinn. You are shot. You get in there. Quinn. Quinn, Quinn, oh, draft. Get in there. Steph, you are looking in here. Comet, you are looking in there. You are looking in here. Molly, you are looking in there. Jaina, you talk to him. Make her follow. And then you go in here. That's full. Dock. There. Accept. Um, Josephina. Josephina, you talk to him. Uh, crew three. Stella, undraft. Um, undraft. Okay, okay, da, 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 da. decline. Goodbye. What are you? Hardworking. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, 
I'm wondering, well, she could be an excellent gunner and she's nine weapons. No, that's Josephina. <laughs> no, she could be eight weapons. We don't need that anymore. She, I mean, ah, uh, Yeah, she's definitely a frontliner. I should probably um, keep her. So, Josefina, you are undrafted. And there are... Who's that? Nikolai. A spacefarer. Good with industry. Good with gunning. Botany, good gunner. Yeah, I, 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 I dig it. I also take him. That's cool. So he has given up, right? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Back to that ship. Uh, Jaina is still going there. I don't need new prisoner instructions. I know how it works. Um, Okay, cool. So all of you undraft. Take that chip, transfer everything. Hmm, nice. We could got two of those. Hmm. Yeah, why not? Works for me. Select all. Done. We want energy scrap. Hull scrap. Do we need tech scrap? Eventually. Should we really like take it apart entirely? By the way, do we get, yeah, seven. That's good. Yeah, works for me. Okay, um, Jaina and Darren in there. Doc. Comet and Taden are sleeping. Yeah, we really need to free that shuttle that's there. People are getting patched up. By the way, who is do who is doing the patching up? Uh, priorities. Franklin, where are you? Should be more to the top, right? Is it? So, medical, he's high. Three of eight. 
Ashton is going to be able to do implants soon. Three of eight. So let's let's tune down Franklin quite a bit. So the others get more incentives, you know, to train on any casualties. Ah, that's awesome. So first shuttle is coming in, second shuttle is coming in. And draft. Ah, right. Did I set up? Yes. <coughs> I didn't set up that one. The prisoner area is the same as the slaver's area, right? Yes. <coughs> Sorry for that. Ooh. Now this means we need like four new facilities. Am I right? Uh, let's build them. That one was like this, right? Yes. And that one goes like such. Search, search. Yep, perfect. That's awesome. So Steph doing the look. Oh! <laughs> and that guy. <laughs> uh, let's reduce that again. Did I, um, are you going? Yeah, you'll be rebuilding that core. Cool. All our beds are occupied. Nice. Why can't I scroll here? Android Corps, hmm. So now we should have Slaver Skilled, that is the hard working guy, and That's Terry, that's Stella, 
that's Jaina, that's Quinn. Where is the other slaver's guild guy? Steve is the cultist, that's also the cultist. That's the slaver's guild guy, zero days, five hours. That's Space Pharaoh, what are your conditions? Lost your leader, A too much. My friend died, my best friend died, wound four. Okay, yeah, but he's good. He's not like bleeding or anything. Um, do I want him? I think so. Hey, Brainburn, how's it going? <clears throat> Hold on, how long is this stream lasting already? Oh, yeah. We have another 10 minutes, that's cool. So, we did all that stuff. Jacqueline and Camille are coming over, joining the robot army and transferring stuff, that's awesome. Nice. I like how my robots are eager to participate in such a salvage operation. <laughs> ah. What is still to be transferred though? Yeah, that's, you know, it's going quite nicely. We need to reproduce those though, but I think we can. You are the Android Collective, yeah, you're good. Actually, hold on a sec. This is civilians, right? But they were Android Collective. That I think is the Android Collective icon. Am I right? Android Collective, or is it just the mining mining station symbol? Hmm. So we have Android Collective and Merchant Federation on our ship now. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm sorry for you. But you know how it goes. So, all is well, brother. Just watching when I can. Yeah, sure, 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 sure. Uh, you may have noticed I have been streaming a bit less frequently. That is just because, um, yeah. You know, not getting um, the peeps watching, kind of. So I figured, well, I wanted to use the streams for other stuff as well anyway, so... Last stream I explored a new game. Kinda nice thing. 
but um, not for me. And uh, I am really, really busy on this city skyline stuff because the city is really going to turn out awesome. So yeah, that's my focus right now. <laughs> and I rather edit through the day than, uh, you know, getting caught up with Oh, that's also a nice haul. Prisoner re recruited Steven. Who is Steven? Steven. Iron stomach farmer. You are a farmer. You don't have no. You're good. Um, oh, yeah, you got quite the skills. Awesome. Huh. Great at shielding. Awesome. <clears throat> You're not good with weapons, though. Let's see. What can we have for you? Um, hmm. An SMG, I guess. Because we have so many of those. And uh, you don't need that. And now Steven. I would like to put you in. How many are in the first shift? It's two, four, five, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, that's okay. Let's leave Steven in the first shift. So somebody who actually works, you know. Welcome back, Elboon. I have fun. I have fun. Um, the railroads game. Um, yeah. Um, let me. Like, I did kind of my summary at the end of the stream yesterday. I really enjoyed that they are actually doing the spin-off um, of the original game with all the narration and the... Um, basically, they made the spin-off to give people the chance to check out if the real game would be for them. So the spin-off is for free on Steam. So everybody can, you know, download it and test, check it out. And what they did there was a really good job. That said, though, I still felt like the game would make me work. And um, I've been working like all day, so... Actually, working is not my preferred thing, so um, I rather, you know, play games which um, I enjoy more. Because you actually have to play the game to unlock lots of automated stuff. And uh, that is like kind of not working for me with this rail dispatcher thing, kind of. But like I'm through the entire stream i was kind of unsure am i enjoying myself is this fun or does it bother me and i still can't say neither nor <laughs> you know what i mean uh, i just noticed it it makes me work but i still did not had a bad time so yeah i really can't tell you know <laughs> How many hours do I have locked for that game? Um, hold on a sec. Uh, let's quickly... We are still busy here anyway, right? So let's see. Let's turn this off. Let's go over Steam. And let's check. I um, Playtime 1066 hours. Yoo-hoo! 
<laughs> Actually, um, I didn't play Factorio, but I checked out Ministry recently. And Ministry is crazy because it's kind of like Factorio, but there you uh, can also have programmable modules which then are going to steer your armies and such and that is so deep and complex that um the thing is it's abstract complex it's not like in cities like in city skylines where you see a world map and you pretty much understand how things work together and i am not so much a fan of coding anymore i did that like for over 20 years and meanwhile, I'm just, I try to avoid it if I can, because, um, like, I was working in IT and it drove me into mental issues. So, um, yeah, I'm not trying to avoid, I, yeah, I'm trying to avoid it. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> but, um, yeah, the game I checked out yesterday was Railroads. And, um... As said, I'm still not sure if I actually really enjoyed it or... <laughs> yeah, how to say that? Yeah, Space Haven, the thing is... I'm probably also not the best... Um, I'm also not playing the fastest. Because as you can see... I am also wasting a lot of time just, you know, checking out what's happening. <laughs> I actually should speed this up, shouldn't I? There we go. Because they are probably going to solve that on their own. But when you're playing Brutal, um, more often than not, you don't want them to do like stupid stuff so that's why i'm watching on on the slowest speed to prevent them from i mean it's just like simple stuff for example a shuttle is docking and that guy who like has waited for the shuttle for ages now just turns around and takes a seat somewhere meaning he's occupied and not going to walk back to the shuttle meaning the shuttle because nobody is walking towards the shuttle is just going to, you know, undock again and float back to our ship. And, and that stuff I cannot let happen because then I have to, you know, draft that guy, put it, put him into the shuttle, fly the shuttle back, yada, 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 that stuff. So um, that's kind of just the behavior, um, just, just to make them stop doing these unnecessary things. And... Uh, which is why I'm often just playing at normal speeds to also like when somebody needs building um, I'm often going like okay build it now <laughs> by the way um, Elbun, um we have two new slaver skilled prisoners and we have two refugees, one for the Android Collective and one for the merchant ship, because we liberated that ship. Actually blew it to pieces pretty easily and I think, yeah, we are reproducing here ammunition and stuff. Oh, they had, they had infusions. By the way, what is my storage thing doing? Do we still have... Oh, we have space in it again. That's cool. Because that was like full, like for a long time. Uh, I don't have double beds. Like, that's the uh, refugees' prisoner area. They have double beds. Those are my normal quarters. 
right? So that's four on either side, then six on either side. Um, but um, like when you were away, I decided we need to stock up to 16. And um, we also need to have like way more of those chambers. So I built four more. Um, the no privacy, no, that's, that's not an issue actually. Actually also I have this um, room up here with two beds right next to each other because um, if we could at some point, where is she? September, right. He, she is a lover with uh, Rick and uh, Rick just got post-surgery, post-surgery inventory. What did he get? Oh, he's done. Cool. So wait a second. What's his skill then? Experience three. He's leveling up to five. That's awesome. Anyway, those two are lovers and I want to, you know, so that's why I built this, um, you know, cozy suite for them. <laughs> like hopefully she's going to join us soon as well. I really wonder like when are we going to be finished here now? I don't think that that is implemented. And right now I can't test it because, um, yeah, the second of the pair is, has not come over, has not joined us yet. <laughs> but, haha. -ha. What happened also in this episode is I finished the entire tech tree. Like we were researching this, um, no, that thing. That was the last tech I didn't have. And now we have everything. <laughs> what? Risk of mental breaks. Terry, what's wrong? Terry, condition. Healing boosted, intoxicated, uncomfortable. I have to sleep in an uncomfortable, see comfort view mode, hold a sec. Comfort sleep. Let's check out our ship. Ah, that room is not optimal. We need to fix that. That is all right. That is all right as well, I assume. Yeah, we need to fix that room. Those two are all right. Those two are all right as well. Okay. We need to fix this room. Okay, uh, let's move that over there. Let's move that There. Let's move the bed. 
Doesn't matter now. Okay, I need to fix this room. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, Terry, what else are your crawl about? Mind discomfort. Feeling a little comf and starting to affect my mood. Interrupted sleep. Because you spend time here. Wound, that's all right. Hungover. I not feel really hope my body recovers. Okay, spacesuit fatigue. And you don't have any friends. That's the real problem. You do not have any friends. Um, Terry, where are you? There you go. Yeah, we need, yeah. Okay. We are soon going to fix that. Ship entered sector. Okay. Da -da, greetings. Trade. Did we trade already? We did. Would we need something? No. Could we sell something? Um... Yeah, like that. And um, you know what you could give us? <coughs> I mean, that's cheap. Remember, if anything has like two digits, up until 10, it's pretty cheap. Would we want to sell something else? Are you stocked up at those? Mm. You're not going to pay a good price for that. Oh, but you don't have any of... Where are they? Up there. You don't have any of these. And you also don't have any of those. Um, you know what? Let's give you a pistol. <laughs> okay, I want that guy. And I want more water. Yeah, that's probably a good deal. Let's do that while they are here. So now, Terry. Okay. So. I want you, somebody, to dismantle that. Thank you. Then I want to move that. I can't right now. Okay, yeah, then move this. There. Hold on a sec. There are enough empty rooms. Okay, now move this over there. Now build a wall there. Um, let's move this thing back there. What's wrong? Ah. Move that thing back there. Oh. Can, can, can I now move it, please? Thank you. And now let's get that thing. 
back in here and let's get that thing back there and now let's also add a light uh, like over there do you have a light no you don't why do you not have a light Did I really forget to put lights in there? I probably did. <laughs> yeah, those have lights, see? Yeah, 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 yeah. Prisoner recruited, Christian. Christian. Nathan led best trend skills. Iron wield. Yes. Great shooter industry. Yeah, 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 yeah. Awesome. Um, Iron wield blacksmith. Do you have the. No, you haven't. Awesome. I want you to get, oh, you have a bulletproof vest. Awesome. So I want you to wear an armored vest now and I want you to wear as a primary weapon an assault rifle. Yeah, we don't have those. Let's give him an SMG. Let's fetch this stuff. And I want Christian to be put in uh, that shift, I guess. Cool. Let's turn those off again. Where's my light? There's no light. There's no light either. Can I get my light in here, please? Thank you. And now I would like to um, redo walls. Because that's now a blue one and I don't have the blue ones for sleeping. So let's change that. Yeah, there's the bookshelf. Let's quick. Yeah, bookshelf. I love bookshelves. And then f the floor is all right. Yeah, the floor is all right. I like, you know, I like bookshelves. <laughs> ah. Okay, so we are done with that chip, we are done with the trade. Let's hop into new adventures. Okay, um, <clears throat> nice. Do they make babies now? Can you show your production area? Yes, sure. Um, okay, let's tune that down a bit. So, uh, engines. Here is the items fabricator. Over here is the tools facility. Then we have the two, like we have three of those hull stabilizers in the ship, like, because they have these areas around them. Let's quickly show you system hull stabilizers. So I could fit exactly six in the ship by putting the, them in those locations. Uh, no, get get away. All right. So then I have that thing in. Now, more important than the actual production area is how all the storage is set up. <clears throat> so uh, here we have the recycler, the um, thing here, and the, the small assembler, right? This chest pretty much only allows all the scrap material. 
um, steel plates and sink, which is coming from the um, the smelter thing, the steel plates and the electronic components. And then it is also allowed to store iron, uh, noble metals, and um, carbon. Yeah, and that's it. So that thing. Here is um, the microweaver and the chemical refinery and the optonics fabricator. So this storage has the following rule set. It is allowed to have a minimum of steel plates because those are sometimes needed in the chemical refinery for ammunition. Uh, it stores all the uh, plastics. It stores that stuff because that is coming from those both botany areas. So that's the only place we actually are going to need it in the ship. So it is close to the micro weaver and it stores the fabrics. It does not store all the fabrics because up here we have other chests which are basically there to have ammunition and yeah, those two ammunition types ready and five of the fabrics. Because normally when I meet a new ship, I want to trade fabrics. So I want to have a close way to the airlock and that's the closest storage. Um, yeah, and those are catch-alls. They're just pretty much for everything that gets dropped off the airlocks to be just stored right away and then later distributed. So anyway, the other fabrics are stored in here because in here they are sometimes needed for doing those thingies and they are also needed by the item fabricator which is down here so fabrics there um, what else yes the fertilizer because the chemical refinery does also fertilizer here are also the real chemical the uh, chemicals in there and it also wants all the raw chemicals in here and because that is just so few things I also made this the chest for storing all those items. Now, that chest, <laughs> this chest has all the blocks are able to be stored in here. Uh, why not those? Yeah. But it wants to be delivered all the Hyperium and all the Energium. So, that always goes into that chest. Then nothing of that stuff. It also does the um, optronic components and the quantronics components. Uh, even though I don't know what for we do need, need those. Doesn't matter. Anyway, this is uh, mainly the storage for the energy thing. Okay. This storage, this has water and the energy rods and the hyperfuel. Hyperfuel getting brought to them. It may store the other stuff, but hyperfuel definitely going in there. It allows a few of those because of the close proximity to the item, item fabricator. It allows plastics and fabrics also for the item fabricator. Then all the um, thingies, all the ice is brought here because here is the ice machine that turns them into water. And that's also why it is allowed to store water. And then what else? Yeah, that's basically it. So this is basically our hyperfuel storage. And over here, this is the chest where pretty much nothing is allowed except of, uh, right, all the blocks. Like how all the blocks are going in here. Yeah, <laughs> so uh, just to give you a quick overview, so you can, you know, internalize that a bit better. Yeah, that one is uh, used for um, if they need to produce that those thingies, those need fruit. So yeah, also in, by the chemical refinery. And over here, it's pretty much just that. Make sense?
The thing is, if you are able to keep... Okay, so let's say you have such a catch-all somewhere in your ship. Doesn't matter where it is. Uh, preferably close to the airlocks, right? If you have this, as soon as they have stored an item in here, they have all the time in the world to actually put it where it really should go. But when it is put somewhere, you rather would have to have only close proximity distances to where the item is going to get used and from where it has been, you know, used for doing stuff, where the items which are a result of this process are going to get stored. So you want to keep, you know, distances of travel short because your crew has actually way better things to do than um, trying to, you know, move stuff. That's so, yeah, basically you try to keep those at a minimum. So, interesting enough, we have another derelict ship here, which is going to cost us our shields. And hopefully we are not getting... Let's deploy here. Let's mine that. Oh, that, that's absolutely worth it. Which... Schedule are we in? Team 1 and Team 2 should be ready. Team 2. No, Team 2 is sleeping. Yeah, Team 2 is sleeping. So, um, how about Team 3? What's wrong with Haruka? Haruka, where are you? You are sleeping. Why are you sleeping? Post-surgery fatigue. Okay, Team Forden. Yeah, why not? You guys are all patched up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I draft you. And you guys go in there. Meow. 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 Okay, I don't think we can last really much longer, but I, I, you know, I just want to explore this derelict ship. So let's do that, because those used to be the only ones which hold um, actual uh, hypersleep chambers back in Alpha. I mean, I'm playing since Alpha Eleven, I think. If I'm not entirely mistaken. <laughs> oh man, this is really costing us our shields, isn't it? Bummer. And now I guess we don't have to wait long. Risk of mental breaks, Terry. Terry, where are you? Terry? Conditions? Minor discomfort, crawl about, lonely. Yeah, that's 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 a really sad thing. I'm feeling lonely. I wish I could make some friends around here. I'm so sorry, mate. Uh, let's see in which shift is Terry. Terry. fourth shift here how about we move you into that shift that sounds like a plan All right so team four I really need to make him fr like he should be friends with somebody Doesn't matter who, actually. Oh, hello. 
Normally I really would love such a ship because of, you know, you get free research points, but since we are all done researching everything, that really doesn't matter to us anymore. What the heck? You come with me, you dog there. I don't think we are going to encounter hostiles here. Yeah, knew it. Okay, let's empty it. That's nice, actually. Should we salvage? No, let's just proceed. Oh, you guys are taking... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, kitty cat, how's it going? Meow. Come on, go... See that? They're talking now. Steph, move it. <laughs> Does it... Ah, uh, amazing, thank you. Makes so much sense, man. Does it make sense to have two ships than just one? I am planning to have a second one, but I feel the game is easier if, you know, every ship requires energy, uh, you know, engines, shielding, Turrets not so much eventually, but um, all the basic stuff and for that I feel it's easier to start with the bigger ship first to have actually a flagship uh, which is why I did the uh, 2x3 thing but I'm also going to build me a 1x2 uh, side vessel and now that I have researched everything the side vessel only is going to need uh, shields and a targeting jammer. Because as long as this is active, nobody can shoot at it. So um, it doesn't require turrets. So I can save a lot of space on that second ship. And I'm probably only going to make it a uh, farm for uh, cryo chambers. Because that's pretty much when I'm just like only transporting people you know and they're all asleep that's it like a little crew that actually you know does the maintenance and navigation and such and that's it um so as a first ship i'd rather start out on a bigger one or if you are playing the abandoned mining station scenario and you don't want to mess with the starting resources then eventually it would be also a cool idea to start with a really small ship. And, but the thing is, there is this research tech tree in the way. So what I wanted to say is start with a small ship and then um, build the bigger one, right? Or um, take over one of the... Um, claimable derelicts um, but personally I feel starting with the bigger ship is the easier gameplay and since this is kind of a brutal let's play I mean it's custom because I actually took the freedom to um, customize my starting crew uh, just because that feature was new and I wanted to check it out so uh, on Brutal normally you don't get this feature, like at all. So I wanted to make, you know, custom Brutal run, kind of. And um, in there it is way easier if you have the bigger ship first and pretty much can do all the research, can do everything and then build the smaller ship one later. Uh, White, show that message. Uh, I see, he started with the 2x2 and felt it was really shitty. So I had to 
build up a one by two so I can get now. Yeah, basically you only have um, like those eight ship points and I have two of those eight left because this is, you know, three by two, so six, so used up six. So I could build another one of these. Uh, yeah, don't want to do that now. <laughs> anyway, I think we are already done for this episode. Yeah, that was a cool run, I guess. So, um, time to run the outro. I am going to head over onto Discord in the next, you know, 10, 15 minutes. Now first need to check out what Kitty Cat has to say and what she's lacking and, you know, then join later. So if you have any more questions, just feel free to hop over on the Discord and um, hit me up. Sure, sure, man. I mean... You know, that's what the <laughs> uh, game mechanics community stream is about. So you guys can ask questions and I can answer them. And pretty much, yeah, actually do some real interaction here and can show you stuff how, how I would do it. Not saying that's the only right way to do it, just saying... Normally, when I do stuff, it's tested and proven. <laughs> at least it works. There may be better solution, but at least those mine work. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyway, uh, good time to save the game, I guess, and uh, prepare for the next episode. 45 already, man. And they already announced uh, the next uh, update. Cool. So, yeah, I'll be over there. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. And you guys leave a like and do all the funny things on the YouTubes.